Well, hello, Capricorns. Welcome to Send the Moon Goddess channel. We're here today to do your mid month, July 2022. Can you believe it? And as you can see, we have moved locations. We are in a new location. I kind of moved you just a tap. All right, Capricorns. So, you might hear background noises that you might not normally hear. And you might see things that you normally would not see here at Sin the Moon Goddess channel. Because we are traveling. And we're going to do a live very soon. And we want you to guess where we are. So... If you have not subscribed by hitting that button over there to the right that says Send the Moon Goddess channel, you need to subscribe so you will be notified, right? Also, that new channel is coming up. Yay! We're going to show you more where we are and where we're going and what we're doing. Yay! All right. All right, helpful corners. Now, you got a lot going on. It says, for mid-month, your card is surrender. Hear ye, hear ye. You are hereby called to unclench your grips on any old thought patterns that are getting in your way. Surrender any ideas that make you feel like a victim of circumstance or which make your dream relationship seem like impossible. The, ma the major of reinventing has just arrived and has made the following decree. Listening benefits about yourself and you are here for, for with, officially and undoubtedly declare for the birds. So you need to undo any limits you have on yourself. Also, any uh, burdens you have with family, uh, your old patterns you've been using with family love, you're gonna have to rethink and redo. That's the message I got about surrendering. All right? All right, let's go, let's get it. Capricorns, as I said, when things happen around you. Okay. All right, spirit. Oh, that's a lot. Can we cut it down some? Oh, where Capricorn is right now? Thank you. Now, what they need to know, what the mm, Capricorn need to know. And, hmm. That to stay there. Here. All right. Mm. Now, couple coins. Yes. All right. There's victory coming this mid month. All right. I feel like you guys can't see for some reason. All right. Now. Where you are right now, mm. you and this person that you are with, you guys are boss couple. You're boss couple. You have strong communication. You have a strong relationship. We're going to clarify, but they're saying that's where you are right now. I don't think that needs to be clarified. You guys are boss couple. You have strong communications and you're working on your relationship. All right? Now, this is what you need to know. Okay, now. You're ending some chapters. You have decided that some of these chapters that's been going on, that you just got to walk away from. It could be, it could be family again by, by you surrendering. Okay? Knowing that you can't do, you, you've done all you could do. Okay? So, uh, it's all about surrendering. And they want you to make that choice to do that, to end some of these chapters, okay? Because, baby, you're being rebirthed. And if you're in love with Scorpio, they say you guys are going to succeed, okay? 
Yes, Cancer, I see too. All right, now. Your actions, Capricorn. All right, you, you got to stop overthinking. You got to take care of your health. You got to take care of your health, okay? All right, and I'm hearing it's your mental health. And that, that's how you're going to take care of your mental health is by surrendering. All right? All right. Now, your, your future. Wow. Do you have something legally going on? If you do, it seems like it's coming to an end. But we're going to clarify because I'm not sure. But it is a legal. It's some, it's some kind of legal matter going. Your advice? Heartbreak. Now, I'm hearing a lot of you are releasing some of the past hurts, okay? Some of you are healing, like this relationship that you are in is helping you to heal. So, allow it, okay? All right, now, <clears throat> I'm hearing, is no more to say than surrender. Give up some of these old, old relationships that it, you can't do anything about any longer. So it's time for you to surrender. Okay? Now, this rebirth, I want to hear about. I want to hear about this. Mm. Alright. They say in this, re, in this rebirth, you are giving up. You are surrendering. You are letting go. <clears throat> you are letting go. Right? And that's helping you. That's helping you to, to accomplish some of your goals that you want to accomplish. Uh, um, you're getting support from other people, from other family members, because you let go of that relationship. Okay? Now you're also getting clarity. You're getting clarity in which direction you should go. So that's why they want you to stop all of this overthinking. Okay? Yeah. Now, they, they saying to be patient with yourself, okay? It's going to take time. But they still want you to go after them goals that you have. <clears throat> all right? Although you healing. I'm, yes. Although you healing, it, they still want you to go after your goals. All right? Because, see, goals can be accomplished at, while you're healing. The queen. Thank you, Spirit. Yes. See, Capricorn. You're, you're healing, and now you're keeping balance. You're healing, and you're working your goals. That's balance. Okay? So keep up the work. That's what I'm hearing. Yes, keep up the work. Now, <laughs> this is a commitment. It's a commitment coming towards you. Yeah. Someone... It could be that Scorpio who's in love with you, wants to come towards you, and they, 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 they want a, they want a commitment from you. This relationship is just going up a notch. It could be with a, um, a Sagittarius, but believe me, this is working out just fine. Now, your advice, uh, <clears throat> with the broken heart, don't worry about it because. You, it's going to be successful. Your healing is taking place, Capricorn. And your healing and your love is, is, is healing you. you. You're going to be very successful in, in healing this grief once you surrender. Okay? Now, this that grief, it doesn't have to be your lover it, or your husband or your, your spouse, I should say. It, 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 it could be a family member that a relationship you might have to let go of. Okay? Yes. Now, the person that you are in love with, this person is telling you how much they love you and they back you. How much... How much how much um, passion they have for you, and how they stand up for you. They are ve they are communicating with you. I, I'm I'm hearing they constantly telling you. It could be a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Okay, they're telling you constantly how they feel about you. 
all right this is your wish this is a love that you you have um manifest some of you are manifesting a new job and and, and that new job is is on its way babies and then you're gonna make some very good money and you're gonna be successful so look out for the communication that's coming very soon capricorns okay you might have to work hard and you might even have to move okay but they want you to take care of yourself they want you to get some rest all right because this is going to be a, a very nice journey for you all right i do see love i do see you getting engaged i do see a commitment coming and also that 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 promotion see right now you are in the limelight you're the one who who the spirit is guiding so the only thing you have to do is listen capricorns all right only thing you have to do is listen and if you do you you will get all the awards that's due to you i do see you might have to move though you might have to find a place because of this new position that you have <clears throat> it's a new job and, and when you do, it's just going to get you closer to family. You guys are going to be really good with uh, sharing each other's boundaries and then respecting each other's boundaries. Okay? You're walking away from hard times. So if you've been having hard times lately, Capricorn, it, it, it's, it's going bye-bye. <laughs> They're going bye-bye. It's, it's time for you to be on top of the wheel. I'm here. Yeah, so you're getting you're getting this new start. Um, a time for for uh, all the bad uh, all the bad things that's been happening um, to go away. Your 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 money will your money will improve, and your love is definitely going to improve if you go towards love without fear. Okay. Yeah. So. Some of you might be work, walking away from a new job, a job that you just recently um, acquired, but it's okay because, baby, this new job that's coming is going to pay you a whole lot more than you was getting on the last job. Now, I'm also hearing, 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 you are hereby called to unclench your grits on any old thought patterns. So you must let go of negativity. You only need to think of the positive things that's getting ready to happen for you. Okay, Capricorns? Positive, positive, positive. Surrender the old thoughts. Surrender any old relationships that's keeping you from going to the new. All right? All right, Capricorns. That's what I have for you for mid-July of 2022. All right, now you know I can't let you go without asking you to like and share this video. And if you haven't already, Capricorns, touch that button on the right. You want to join us here at Send the Moon Goddess channel? I know you do. All right, I love you, Capricorns, and I'm out.